Hey guys, I'm sorry if you think the quality is not as good as it normally is, and that's because I'm filming near these fairy lights. If you focus. Anyway, the reason for today's video is because this person right here wanted to know how I got the green screens on this video. That actually was a really bad video I made a long time ago, but it's okay, it's okay, you can still watch it. And I'm going to show you how to do just that. So stay tuned. Oh yeah, and stay till the end for bloopers. For this tutorial, the apps you will need are... Okay, so let's begin. First, you want to go onto YouTube and type in green screen title or title green screen, same thing. And then I chose this video, the link will be in the description and up here right now. And you click the video, you click this button here which says share, and you put copy link, come off of YouTube, go onto documents, and paste that address and click go. And then where it says M between the dot and YouTube, you want to type in SS. You will be taken to this screen. You have to click download and then wait. Then this screen will come up and just click save. Then you click this folder icon and go into downloads. Hold down this, go back, then put it in photo albums and we'll have this moving icon on the screen. So now this is in your photos, you're going to want to go onto video style. So first you're going to click the plus button, click edit video and select the video that you want to put the green screen on. Once you get to this part, click these scissors, then click new, import clip, and then import this video that we just saved. And you'll need to set the like timing so you get the green screen in the video. Then click import and wait for it to load. After that, click new, multi-layer clip. For your back, use your video and for your front, use your green screen. Then click next, click color, then click the background so it goes gray. Then click next. After you remove the so after you remove the green, you should come to this bit and you have your title in the middle of the screen. Resize that to wherever you want it to go and then click create, yes, and this is the point where we have to add the text. So to add the text you have to click new multi-layer clip again, use your other clip then go on text and type in whatever you want to type in, I'm just going to leave this just for the example, next and then you want to Resize where you want it to go, um, and that's basically it. You can fade it in and fade it out if you want, but just for this video to be quick, I'm not going to do that. So, this is what it looks like. Obviously, you can make it look better than this when you do it without having the text. Like that you can have it fade in and fade out and whatever you want. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, bye! Hey guys, sorry if the quality is not as good as it is not at the Hey guys, as you can see I've got a different place. Oh gosh, this isn't focusing.